Let's talk about food. Food is not the enemy. I used to think this way when I was 152 kilos. So we need to make better choices when it comes to food. I'll show you how you can still eat chocolate and chips and pizza and enjoy the food without feeling guilty. Pudding, protein pudding. Okay, so this one here you, will, you need to put into the fridge and afterwards. Okay, so I have a blender. I haven't used this one before. It's one of uh, Loretta's new gadgets. You probably would have noticed that Loretta loves gadgets. So I'm gonna make sure that's turned off. Okay. Sounds good. Okay, so. Fresh strawberries as opposed to frozen. And strawberries on special at the moment, they're like two big punnets for $5, even $6 for three. We've got a third of a cup of chia, 30 to 40 grams of protein powder, just plain protein powder. And I am using, this is a better alternative than maple syrup, I am using rice malt syrup. Right, it's less damage. It's got, um, you know, I mean, there is sugar, there's no doubt, but it's a lot less. So if I was, if I would recommend, this one here is also, um, it's an alternative to honey, suitable for vegans, and it's gluten-free, all natural, pure harvest, rice syrup. And 100 mils, or 150 mils, of, of milk or almond milk or coconut water. It's whatever you desire to add in there. And then our two cups to go in there as well. And if you want to make it a bit more fancy, what we have done of late is that we just got like a nice little nut mix, like a, a granola mix. I'll come around and show you. It's like a, a granola mix that has, yeah, pistachio, everything. Yes, Leanne, there's a certain brand that I buy when it comes to protein um, around in Australia, and it's called BSC, Body Science. So this one here is called Low Carb Protein, Lean 5 and it's pure protein. Yes, it's no soy, gluten-free, no added sugar, and that's that you can at least mix what you want to mix into. So BSC, lean, low-carb protein powder. Nice big bread container. Hello, hello, I can see you, hello. <laughs> I was told this one has to be in there. Happy. So let's put in some, I mean, what order do we put this in? I tend to try and put the milk so it's not floating in there as much. So it's above the blade. And then I'll put the strawberries in there. And then I'll add protein powder. It smells really nice, this particular protein powder. And then I'll add the chia, a third of a cup of chia seeds. I'll tell you why, it keeps you regular. It is for sure. I've noticed that. I know, maybe a bit, just a bit too much information, but it's, yeah, chia is really good for your digestion system and a tablespoon, so I'm trying to make, and you find that this particular uh, syrup, it doesn't stick too much to the spoon, so you, you, won't, you won't get as much wastage. 
and just hmm. once again for anybody else I'll bring it closely that's it there More milk. If you know what, if you want to know what milk I use, I use Zimmel. This tends to work better with my system. I'm not too worried about that. So the next step is now we've got all that in one spot. Now it goes back on top. Now I've been told that I need to put this on the whisk function. Okay, so it's in there. Power's on. Let's make sure that my mic hasn't turned off. That's all good. Right. Okay, hope you can see that. And power comes on. That would help. 10, 9, 8, 7, Six. There we go. So the whisk has it by itself, almost for six seconds. So do I need to do it again? Off it goes. Okay. So that's it. How amazing is that? So just two. You can put two nice cups, or you can put it into a bowl. I'll just put it into a cup for now, or into a nice glass. Okay, power off. Down on twist. There she goes, this is strawberry. God, that smells, that smells really nice. So you can see enough for two. And like I said, if you want to, you can add some granola on top. Don't really have to, but I'll just do it because it just, it tastes great. It gives a nice crunch at the same time as well. And just sprinkle on top. And I'll bring it and I'll show you. See, you can see the consistency and then the nice on top. And you put that into the fridge and let that set for about an hour. And then you will have your nice dessert once you've eaten dinner. So there is a little bit left there. I'm going to finish it before everybody gets home. I'll just do it with a taste test. Oh, that's amazing. That's really amazing. I'll leave some for Loretta because I feel bad if I don't leave some for her. But one thing I have left for her as well is the dishes. <laughs> It's a mess, but we've got dishwasher, so it's okay. Now, I always help out in the kitchen. It's all good. I think those who know of me know that I'm pretty. I hope that you will love the shows. I know sometimes they go long, but it's okay because you can always come back and, and watch them later on. Wait, Last planner, which I put together, 150 pages of recipes, movements, mindset. It's all about choosing a lifestyle that you love and that you can do and adapt to for the rest of your life. Now, enough talking because I can talk underwater. 
you can have this for dessert, you can have this for snack, you can have this for lunch. At the end of the day, it doesn't really matter when you eat it, just eat when you're hungry. Don't eat when you're not hungry, and don't eat because it's 12 o'clock or 5 o'clock or it's breakfast. So just listen to yourself, everyone's different when they're hungry, and just make sure that you eat something which you really love and enjoy. And this is the whole idea when it comes to the Let's Cook episodes, it's just giving you some ideas and bringing fun back into the kitchen. Once again, take a look at my website. I've got some great recipes and meal plans. Make sure you download the Ultimate Weight Loss Planner. I know I'll keep on saying it, but it's my heart and soul into this one. It's a free download. There's no gimmicks or catches or tricks or potions or any of that. It's a good old, honest download of all your recipes, exercises and mindset you can do and most importantly for six months you can track and you can progress and, and, and track your progress and then adjust along the way when it comes to losing weight for the very last time but at the end of the day you must love your new lifestyle and be able to adapt to it for the rest of your life once again thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it i'm Sylvester, known as a weight, as a weight loss king helping women Lose weight for the very last time. Buon appetito, and I'll see you soon. Any questions, please leave a comment, and I will get back to you. Thank you. Bye for now.